Don't look too strong. I'll make it. before you. Link to it. Insert yourself. Then search for me on the other side. Come on. Lean on me. I can do this. So listen. All I know for sure is all it's bound to stage a coup in my head. Can't know who'll be coming back from this cyber jaunt. So I gotta thank you now. V, shut up and do whatever you have to do. Any parting advice? Just be yourself. Let us go then, you and I, when the evening is spread out against the sky, like a patient etherized upon a table. Let us go through certain half-deserted streets, the muttering retreats of restless nights in one-night cheap hotels, and sawdust restaurants and oyster shops. Streets that follow like a tedious argument of insidious intent to lead you to an overwhelming question. Oh, do not ask what is it. Let us go and make our visit. Gotta admit, you cobbled together a good plan. Been my curse and my nightmare, Johnny. But I do owe you one thing. Day to day, with Silverhand by my side, I learned to kick down barriers. Now, nothing can hold me back. I can feel it. Is that so? Meaning you've made a decision about us? Want a word with Alt first. Where is the wench? Haven't caught on yet, have you? What? What do you mean? Alt's already split us. Once you jacked into Makoshi, she lit you up with Soul Killer. Your output don't fuck around. I am not his girlfriend. Hey. 
Hey, Alt. So seeing as we seem to have the soul splitting out of the way, what's next? I am currently verifying the checksum and eliminating engram copy errors in the process. Wait, you mean... I... Am I a construct? She means you followed in my footsteps. Next steps to copy you into the gonk's brain. So that's really it. We're done. You kept your word. There is one aspect I failed to take into account. Alt? What? The body is a key factor in this transaction. DNA reconfiguration by the relic has progressed too far. Added to aggressive, invasive medications, the body's immune system attacking its own neurons... Christ, will you just skip to the end? After I transfer your construct into your body, you will die. It is inevitable. It is imminent. No. No way. That was not our deal. You shall live for about six months. Perhaps somewhat more. No, no, no. There's gotta be something. Something we haven't thought of. Your body will see you as an intruder. But it's my body! The biochip's nanites have altered it permanently. The body is now Johnny. Alt, give us a minute. V and I need to talk. I can't, I can't believe it. Everything. All we did. It was pointless. I've had enough of this. Of everything. You most of all. Perfect. Because we're sticking to the plan. I'm going with all fuck knows where. You're keeping your body. Where's she even gonna take you? Beyond the Black Wall. To become part of her. Whatever the hell that means. There's a really no other way. As I said, Johnny can retain the body and remain there while you come with me. This I meant. I don't know. A happier ending. For everyone involved. Here? For folks like us? Wrong city. Wrong people. You have the right to make a choice you have earned. Through will and endeavor. This bridge leads deeper into cyberspace. Cross it and permanently sever the connection with your body. The path to your body passes through that mortal well. Johnny, change your plans. I go, you stay. Turn in your back on the problem again? Guilt creeps in, and that's that? You give up? Stop. Just stop. Gonna just roll over instead of fighting for what's yours? Decommiss yourself because you're too fucking scared to say goodbye? It's my decision. Let me make it. you that. But damn it, are you dense. Haven't changed a bit since we met. I'm so damn tired, Johnny. I just want to start anew. Even if I don't know what that means. It better be good for you, too. V, I'm just... I'm just scared for See you around, Johnny.
Gotta say, update's quite an improvement. Shit, got a pack too. And I gotta stop talking to you, V. Best not leave this lying around. Got a bit of time. Think I'll manage to swing by and visit you. Not much, but I'm all right with that. Gonna need a ride. Steve. Gotta talk to Steve. Got that new album from Curse These Metal Hands. First four. Need wheels and a good driver for the day. Couple of things in town I gotta take care of. No problem. I'll take you. My mom wakes out when I don't tell her I'm leaving. But it's not like she can hear me when I try to warn her. You ready? Hey, so when I play a lot, my fingers hurt. What do I do to stop them? You don't. Metal strings cut into your fingertips, make them sore. Just how it is. Oh. Don't worry. Play long enough and you'll get calluses. Start hitting those... What do you think you're doing, you little shit? Going out. Where? Uh... Just out for a sec. Be back soon. Back inside, now! I'm not about to let you go out, do who knows what, you hear? Fuck's sake, you swipe my keys again? Inside! Now, you shit! Hey, relax. Why so tense? Steve's helping me out. 
He'll be back in two hours. Tops. Charlie. I decide when the punk comes, goes, what he does. Not you. He won't come back empty-handed. Two hours. And you hand me those eddies as soon as you come through the door. All right, Dad. Who the hell's that? Who the fuck knows? Another tramp? All look the same to me. Probably a yapper. Goddamn Don't have to pay me, you know. In I our know, shorts. but dear dad's gonna want those My eggs. Steve started talking to him. Sure he is, now he but I know how to cobble some together myself. Hop in. Whip that boy in line. Where are you gonna get the scratch? Promise you won't tell? Merc's honor. Mrs. Juarez pays me to clean her place, but I don't gotta do anything. It's already clean. Think she's lonely. Just want someone to talk to. Could very well be true. Where to? Time machine. Nice! Saw Carrie Uridine there once. You a fan? Of the legend? Of course I am! Why? Aren't you? Carrie's all right. Heard something on the radio about Carrie using Silverhand's death, writing that to fame. Can't do much about media vultures. Got shit for brains, especially the ones who cover music. Carrie's a damn good musician. That's all that counts. The real deal always has been in every way. God, makes it sound like you know him. Cause I do. I'm gonna be a musician someday too. Gotta start scribing songs then. You'll get good with practice like anything else worth doing. The sooner you start, the better. Got a few tunes in my head already. Preem. Lyrics don't come easy though. I come up with anything, seems like it's already been done or it just sounds stupid. I kinda don't really know what to write about. Write what you know about it. Golden rule of songwriting. Any writing, really. But I don't hardly know anything. Maybe our building, I guess. First of all, that's bullshit. And second, tower life's potentially great material. And third, there's always a third thing. You're young. Give yourself time. Ideas will come. Life will shake you, roll you, maybe embrace you. The music will find you. arrived. Preem, hang here a minute. Nah, I'm coming in. Flip through the new releases. What can I do for you? Looking for a six street electric. We'll see. Feast your eyes. Something solid and true. What? And they're not? No offense, but I'm looking for a real instrument. And willing to pay real money. Ah, should have said so. Come on, let's go out back. this I'm coming too whoa to the Fucking right awesome. and left the latest chromatics and Henderson's vintage axes in the back
Deleuze Orphean? Not a fake. Take a good look. Relax, just making sure. Looks authentic, well maintained. Must be around, shit, 70? 90 and still going strong. Fretboard's pure organic ebony. Wanna try this one? Be my guess. I'ma let you two play around in here alone. Else those savages out front will clean out half the store. <laughs> Anyone play Silverhand like that? You know, I read he never took any lessons. Chum was totally self-taught, made up his own style. How do you do that? I mean, sound just like him. Good ear, kid. No one can imitate Silverhand's style. But you did. I just heard you. Obviously, got a bit of him in me, or a lot. Maybe I am Johnny. But how? Johnny'd be like 80 million years old, and you're like, way too young. Yeah, it's hard to explain. Ha! <laughs> yeah, right, Chum. Better try a little harder next time. Still haven't explained how you do it. Don't worry about that. Just come up with your own style, and all you need for that is practice. And talent. Talent you got. Really? You think so? I just don't say things I don't think are true. Not anymore. Best day ever. Fuck! My hands are shaking. Rockers are rebels. They always speak their minds. Tried once with my dad, you know. Didn't go so well. In time, you learn who you really are. What you really want from the world. I don't understand. Want to be a real rebel? Gotta be yourself first. Be authentic. Rebels are made, not born. Made from the punches life throws at them. The punches they take. You know, you're weird. But I like you anyway. Huh. You're alright, kid. Gonna play some more? Nah, short on time. Let's pay. Delta out of here. says there's gonna be another cope war liable to jump at each other's throats any day now think it's true think there'll be another war asking the wrong guy got no interest in the topic couldn't care less to be honest know why why because I realized I don't have to 
Got a friend who lives around here. Where? Can't see it from here. Just saying. He a good friend of yours? Invited me over to his house once. His mom made lunch. Then we went and hung out on the bridge. I like driving through here. It's nice. You know what? You're right. It is nice out here. Never been out this way? No, I have. Just never noticed. Never had time to just sit down and watch. City slipped through my fingers. Just sped right by. Passed underfoot, overhead, and I can't even say when it happened. Gonna write a song about it? Maybe. Nice pendant. Looks good on you. Not actually mine. So whose is it? Belonged to a guy I knew. Crazy as fuck. And now I'm here, and in his place. He dead? Mm, this piece of lead killed him. What are you gonna do with it? Put it back where it belongs. Can I come with? Now wait here, okay? Won't be long. Okay. Obsessing over what happened. Couldn't forget you anyway. I'm wearing your goddamn face. Thanks for. Huh. Well, for everything.
to now hey hey what's this want one gave all that up so should you bad for your body bad for your soul where to now me nowhere but you'd better get home Steve thanks The person you just, uh, visited, he died a while ago? Not that long ago. You miss him? A little, yeah. When my grandpa died, I missed him a lot. But now I only miss him sometimes. Mm. I know you're a free bird and all, and you're gonna do what you want, when you want. But you could at least let me know you're alive, you know? I, I don't want to say anything, but you missed your last checkup. And like I told you a million times, uh, 
Just call when you can, okay? See ya. V, déjate de pendejadas. Straight to voicemail again? What's going on with you, eh? Lose your tongue or what? Ah, sí, claro. I know I wanted to tell you I, I'm cooking a supper on Sunday for Jackie's birthday. All his favorite food. <laughs> Chilaquiles, tamales. If I could get some real corn, oh, maybe even a lote. <laughs> It'd be nice if you could come over. Think about it. Cuídate, amorcito. Take care, love. wondering how you've been. Haven't heard from you in a while. Still living large in Night City? I don't know. All I think about is dropping everything and leaving. <laughs> Yet, here I am still. Oh, the city's like quicksand. The more you try to get out, the more it pulls you in. Once you're up to your knees, you're never getting out. Like Evelyn. Anyway, look out for yourself, okay? And call me sometime. Bye. Really? You're just gonna avoid me? Of course you wouldn't, you fucking coward. Here's a bit of advice for you, Johnny. Enjoy your new lease on life, because it's not gonna last long. I'm serious. Believe me when I say I'm going to find you, you fucking psychopath. Wherever you're hiding. And when I do, I'm gonna rip V out of your head. Don't ask me how, but so far I'm counting on sheer will. You know what you are, Johnny? A parasite. A fucking tapeworm. You hear me? Enjoy the little time you have left. <laughs> v. Hey. Christ, that run we did. My heart's still pounding. A pack of nomads versus Arasaka. Oh, I mean, the odds were totally stacked against us. I didn't know if we'd get out alive. But hey, we made it. And you know why? Because you were the one leading the charge, V. The craziest, baddest merc from Pacifica to the Appalachians. I don't know what you're up to right now, what your plans are. Just remember, we've walked through hell and back with you, brother, anytime. Until next time, eh? Take care. Got your message. Johnny, look, I've been around long enough to know that anything is possible in your fucked up world. But I never imagined this, even from you. You must have made a pretty big impression on V for getting him on board with this, so hats off. I'm just wondering how you feel about that, Johnny. Having another person give their life for you. Especially when you're probably just back to all-nighters and cheap tequila, laughing at how stupid he was. Or has your conscience finally learned its lesson? That is, if you've even got one. Good luck out there, Johnny. And don't ever come back to Night City. Hey, V, so funny thing just happened. Oh, fuck, fuck's sake. Voicemail again. Do you ever answer the phone? Like, ever? Seriously. I can get through to data term customer service faster than you. What did I even want? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that us cracks agent called me and asked if I would go on tour with them? At first, I was like, over oh, my dead fucking body. But then I thought... Hey, wait. I could actually be fun. So, man, uh, what else? Well, there's the latest gossip for you, if you even care. Call me back when you can, okay? Peace out! Hey, V. Sorry to bother you. I know you're a busy man and everything. But, well, I was wondering how you were doing, so I laid out a quick tarot and... Oh dear. The hanged man. The magician. The 
the star. Those... those are not good cards, V. They're really bad. They're something like death, but... not quite. Take care of yourself, okay? I'll... I hope to hear from you soon.